maybe it will change at some point but i don't plan to use agents i've had my fair share of bad experiences with agents i'm searching for the houses myself so i'm just preparing to step out to check our very first apartment i'm excited for it i've seen the way the outside looks like but i don't know how it looks like inside it's not even 7 a.m yet it's six something i hear the landlord is not usually home during the day so i want to kind of catch him early in the morning first place we are checking out is close to where i stay that is in trazako close to phase two this apartment complex offers two bedroom apartment and three bedroom apartments the one we are checking today is a two bedroom apartment now i'll get into the price in a bit but most of the accommodation here at Razako quotes their prices in usd so as we visit this apartment in cases where the prices are quoted in usd i'll convert to ghana city and where the amount stated in ghana city i'll convert to usd using the current conversion rate so that you will have an equal measure of currency so to avoid any form of <laughs> confusion in every house that we visit you will see me opening and closing things touching stuff and switching things on and off that is my way of knowing the appliances and the things in the house are working and functional and if it's not i have the opportunity to ask if they are going to fix it or they expect tenants to fix it is something to know helps in decision making I really like this apartment, but me and my budget are not in sync right now. This apartment is going for 700 US dollars. This two bedroom comes with two and a half bath, a dining nook or area, a living area, a good size kitchen, comes with a pantry just at the entrance of the kitchen. You get a front porch and a balcony. Also, the apartment complex comes with a complimentary pool in the house. They have an in-house security and a huge car park, which I like. This next apartment is located at East Legon, close to American House. Uh, there is one thing about this apartment that I don't really like. We'll get to that in a bit. So this is a two-bedroom apartment going for 700 US dollars. It comes with a two and a half bath, fitted kitchen, living area, fitted AC in all their rooms. were compact like a little bit smaller than the standard then this is what i don't like about this place a very small and i mean very small parking space they have 12 two-bedroom apartments at this complex but they have parking space that can park only three cars three what's now this is the only day I went to school junction and this is the only apartment I checked also. And of course, it was paid for by some Nigerian gentlemen. 
on that same day. The place was really beautiful and private. I really like that about it. It was going for 2000 Ghana City and it was a two bedroom apartment. Okay, Jolly, thanks, Laura. Congratulations. Thank you. Our next apartment is a two bedroom apartment located at East Legon, specifically in Obojo. The going rate was 1,500 Ghana CD per month with a 3,000 Ghana CD security deposit. I'll be honest, I felt the 3,000 security deposit was a tad bit too high. comes with one and a half bath, a laundry room, a living area with fitted AC. The rooms were okay. I like the laundry room feature, but the environment and the compound wasn't doing it for me. So this was an outright no for me. Still as East Legon, this apartment complex offers a broad range of apartments from one bedroom apartments to four bedroom apartments and I checked out only the one bedroom apartment. This place is fitted with a wardrobe, one bath, a living area, and a kitchen. was $400 but when I had a sit down with a landlady she was so so sweet the conversion rate then was 11 but she told me to make it nine so instead of paying 4,400 per month I will be paying 3,600 per month if I decide to go with this apartment <laughs> 